What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into uh, it's titled "Entitled Man Won't Leave Girlfriend's House Goes Away in Cuffs." Okay, let's react to that. Let me get it. I'm not leaving until all my sh is off. You understand? On October 10th, 2022, we're gonna get cuz off here. And a Brower who explained the situation. Matter of fact, hold on, because maybe we need to know the situation. Two. At 1.56 a.m., Officer Rayapin was dispatched to a disturbance at a residence in Georgia. Upon arrival, Officer Rayapin always, spoke with... Always in Georgia, ain't it? Miss Krishana Brower, who explained... Krishana! ...the situation. The 18 trash bags out there in the hallway. Hey, What's going how on? You? How y'all doing? Can you please conversate with him? He I live here. Legend. I got into an argu argument with her mom. She doesn't even live here. He didn't. So honestly, she should probably drunk, be the one leaving, sir. Mm -hmm. He's been. He just came home two hours ago. We had an issue a couple days ago because he has a really bad alcohol problem, oh, and I, I told him. Sir. Hold, hold, on, hold on. Let me finish. I told him, I said, look, you cannot stay here as long as you're drinking like this. So he's been at his mom's house for a couple of days. Uh -huh. I asked him if he was coming back because uh -huh. I was under the assumption that he was going to get his self help she or sign up back. for help, sign up for help and come back. When he showed up, he already had alcohol in his system. And I had a conversation with him before he came in here. And I said, you know that you are not to have no alcohol in my house. He had a wine bottle. And I said, that wine bottle cannot come in here because you act a fool when you drink. Of course, he gets in here. He called himself trying to do a good thing by giving clothes and shoes to my brother and sister. But he was being extremely, thing. That's just me. extremely loud. And I told this him, I, I said, do. my mom's spending the night, which he knew. I said, she has to work in the morning. You can't keep being loud. And my mom called me in there. I was like, look, I have to go to work in the morning. Can you tell him to quiet down some? He comes in the room and starts an argument because he's like, oh, well, I live here. I'm trying to give your kids. I, I understand I'm being loud, but it basically it is what it is. And does I, he live here? Huh? Does he live here? Yes, sir. I live here for once. Her mom does not live here. Okay, that, that, that's, that's, that's not what I asked. There. Yes, sir. Do you live here? Yes, I live here, sir. Your name on the lease? Yes, sir. His name is not on the lease. Actually, sir, her name is not on the lease. My name is not on the lease. Nobody's name is on the lease. If you want I know you ain't about to snitch on my CPN. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh, I know you ain't about to snitch on the CPN. Only reason why I'm not getting up is because my titties are hanging low. I know. If you know, you know. I know you're not snitching on my CPN. It got to be a CPN. Matter of fact, her name's not only, my name's not only, nobody's name is on the list. Wait a minute. What do you mean? Whose house is this? Niggas. Ah. Let me be honest. The my, name on the lease is Michael Allison. And that's you? No. no it's my, not me. It's not her. It's the father. My dad is So the, nobody that lives here is on the lease. Okay. I'm being 100% sure with you. Okay. Yes, sir. But honestly, sir, I will leave tomorrow. But Ain't no way in hell you done snitched on the pops. Can somebody give Zari gifts up? Kia, tell Zari how to uh do whatever it is that you did. I forgot what you told me, but you you know what you did to to be able to get sub. I just want enough courage to stay here. This is tomorrow. I have two children that live here. I was trying to provide for those children. The children are his. Hmm. Yes, That's sir. his children. So I'm not trying to, and I, don't I will, want them to if see. you leave, I will be quiet. I will not say anything I else. I don't know. You was told already, and now we're in this situation. Now I'm here. This is all of my stuff in here, sir. I'm not trying to start any calls or anything. Because I down multiple times. And well, I just left, and I just came back, sir. Go ahead. Talk, sir. So. You want me to leave, sir? Yeah. Okay. I'll call my mom. Can I call my mom? To pick hey, call, me up? call your mom. Cool. Can you hold the door for him? Cool. Hi. No problem at all. Drunk as heck. Now, why is it 600 people in the house in this apartment? Oh, I forgot the kids. I forgot the kids. Y'all, these damn kids look like adults these days, girl. We all the same height around this. 
So, I think this is a child, he's a child, and this the mama on the couch. Then you got the little baby. This could have been situated tomorrow when I said so, but hey. Not Get me. your drunk ass on. He can't even stand up right. My mom is, sir, can I tell you one thing? Come, come outside, come outside. Before I come outside. Come outside. I don't want to come outside if I'm not leaving. But my mom. Come outside. It's on a heart come, condition. Come, come over here. Sir, I'm not coming outside. I'm going to talk to you from right here. You can hear me. I can barely hear you. I'm going to call my mom yeah. so you can hear me. Because everybody... Not the cops say he can barely hear him. Nah, that's Cap. We can hear everything on his good mic. No, What's man. your name again? I ain't going to lie. I got to turn all the way up, though. His name is Brandon Howard. Brandon. I'll give you an ID. You check my ID. If I want to Can you find me, Chris? I want to go home. Call for. Hmm? How far your mom lives, Brandon? Snellville. Oh. Far away. But if she doesn't answer, if she doesn't answer, I can find somewhere to go two miles away. But um, understand. And got a side piece up the street two miles away. Where you going? All of this stuff in here is mine. So we want to play that game. I'm not leaving until all my shit is off. You understand? You can call supervisor, you can call backup. All of this shit is mine. All of this shit, the groceries are all. You understand? No, nigga. Baby, let me tell y'all something. When I used to have my little spats because I had to just leave, everything's staying. <laughs> Everything belongs to them in the first place. That's why you bought it. <laughs> Nigga, I, I done told Honey Sauce a couple times, I just need my computer. <laughs> just, give, just give me the computer. You keep everything. Keep Mango. Keep, keep everybody. The chill, just give me my computer. <laughs> you know, take your computer, bitch. You know, when you look back at these moments or when you look at other people who had these moments, it's <sighs> just, just, niggas say stupid shit. That nigga said, I need everything up in this. <laughs> you see honey sauce and can buy lead the kids and, and, and mango. Listen, you don't matter in this moment, my boy. Get out. <laughs> You're disturbing the peace. So you can smile, but I'm not trying to be defying anything. Yeah, yeah, listen, you, Yo, you said not the cop laughing. <laughs> the cop nigga. Now, come on. You know, you. Why are you starting this? You want to comply. You don't want to be defiant. You're saying all this stuff. I'm complying. But all you're doing right now is being defiant. I have a right to my stuff, right? <laughs> Correct? Uh, uh, nobody Call said you don't have no right to your stuff. Call one nobody one. said that. I have a right to all of my stuff. So uh, according to the law, I have 30 days to leave on my leave. Now in Georgia, this is true. And you got, not only do you have 30 days to leave, if you don't get, um, what you call it? If you don't get served, and I believe you got to get served by the person that's in the house. But if you don't, that's, uh, that owns or, or whatever's going on. If you don't get served, you can still stay in Georgia. Them squatter rules and like staying somewhere in Georgia, nigga, they the worst. The worst. Please. But not if you're acting erratic. Miss, please. Listen, listen to me, Brandon. I'm listening, sir. Okay. Right now, you're acting erratic. Look how everybody is around you. They're all spooked. You scared, all scared the kids, the grandkids. Okay, so hold on. Everybody. We came to the conclusion that you said it's okay to leave. You go look for somewhere to go. Hold on. Nigga say I thought what about it. You, hold on. Hold on. Let me finish. Go ahead, sir. You said you was going to look for something. You called your mom. Yeah. You said she's not picking up. You she, said you got somebody. I hate dirt. You got somebody within two miles to come pick you up. Go it. ahead and call them. Go ahead and call them. Disgrace. Okay? Yes, sir. I'm going to call the code these. Looking like the TV in Ray room. All she do is watch him all day long. <laughs> Four ninety-seven in Union, California. And she called my call mom for. beforehand. This is like disgraceful because I didn't. No, it's right here. 
Why not talk to Arkansas your- gives a three day notice and the sheriff come and they don't have tennis laws either. Damn. But it's cool. I call. I call. Miss, don't don't aggravate him. Just leave him alone. Just leave me alone, cause I'm I'm belligerent. I'm asking to stay at my home because we had a problem with some outsiders. Damn, that nigga said outsiders. Not them yo kids, outsiders. <laughs> and he looked dead at her too. So if you don't get the f out, you better look away from me. Because I just have my composure. Do you live here? Why don't you leave? Do you live here? Does Do anybody here? in this house live Brandon, here? Brandon, Brandon. Nah, at this time, technically no. Brandon, 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 I just blow the whole cover. Nobody listen. Michael Allison lives in Greenville. They can't live with me. Where they can be acceptable. She's not even a mother, bro. I teach my children everything you know. This is like unbelligerent. And I'm trying to get your children school clothes. Oh, I forgot. Uh, brothers and sisters. So I forgot about that. So the mama's kids is there too. Y'all, how we forget that that fast? So the mama's kids is there and his own kids, too. Let's, fo let's focus on getting it right. First of all, let's just talk about it. He tired because all them people up in the house. That's why he's getting drunk. But his ass needs to go somewhere else. <laughs> focus on getting it right. So that we can keep the peace. So guess what, sir? Apparently, What's I can't find a ride. You can't find a ride? Give me a ride. I ain't give you a ride, yeah. Where, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Give me a ride to Snellville? I don't know about that far. Well, unless I get a ride to Snellville, I'm not going anywhere. I live here. Well, we found out nobody lives here. Okay. And you're the one that's so acting out. Everybody else out? And you're the one that's out of control right now. Right? I'm out of control. I'm sitting down. Aiden hey, Legend, come here. No, come here, Aiden Legend. Go on, y'all, bro. These are my children right here. They live with me. I teach them how you say hey in Spanish. Put the kids down, Brandon. I don't have anywhere to go right now. If you want to, hold on. No matter of fact. Ah, oh, cute babies, too. Oh, uh, niggas. I'm over there. I've already talked to her. I call her. She did not answer. And you did not answer. I call her. Uh, um, I call her. She did not answer. So from this point, we can, we can, you know, video, record, whatever, you know. Losses are always necessary. Cause we have a lot of money. Call, call your mom again. You when I tell you, Honey Sauce would have got them kids. <laughs> Shoot them like, put my kids down. And you, one thing about Honey Sauce, she don't yell. Well, she don't have to. She will, but put my kids down. Oh. <laughs> they might. <laughs> I'm just surprised she's still over there sitting. Girl. You see over here? Put my it's not down. necessary, sir. So like I told you, sir, I live here. Call your mom again, Brendan. Sir, I called my mom multiple times. No, you didn't multiple times. Because she didn't answer. But guess what? I live here. You see my children here with me? I'm holding them. Okay. Everybody can laugh, do whatever they want to do, but this is real. I think he was scared at that point. Like, but yes, sir. Um, I called them. Nah, that's I, why I said that. She said, no drunk man holding my baby's daddy or not. That's why I said, honey, sauce has been like, give me my kids. Because not only is he drunk, he's belligerent. The police right there are like, come on, bro. I will leave tomorrow. If that's okay with you. You don't live here, you don't know what's going on. We are arguing because her mom... Wants to go to work, but guess what? Her mom is here spending the night. Bre Brandon, Brandon, what you're doing right now is not resolving any of the issue that's going on right now. None of it. Hi, police. That's you. Mm -hmm. That's him. Let me speak. So, are you going to call your mom to give you a ride or what? Are you resolving the issue, sir? Well, I can resolve the issue by taking you with me. And take you to jail for disorderly conduct. Disorderly conduct. Really? Okay. Just let me shoot. Wow. 
So I'm this early kind of user. I feel like I'm being as positive and as calm as I possibly can. That's fine. You can be positive in the camera. That's not what happened two minutes ago before you put on the camera. Okay, but I'm recording. And it's funny how you took the children on top of you to shield yourself from me. No, I got my okay? children because he's my Yeah, yeah I know. I know. It's funny how that works, Brandon. Yes, sir. You think you think I, I just started doing this? No, sir. <laughs> I'm just trying to say something. You think I'm wanna, making um, funny money, nigga? Relax. Because go to sleep. Brandon, I'm telling you right now. Take a nap. I'm telling you right now. All of my stuff. The, the kids, the kids right on top of you, is not going to save you. It's when I'm done. Me, when I'm not. Sir, when I'm not. I'm, not say, I'm asking you, please, sir. To so calm for. down. By the time. <laughs> not to ask you to calm. Now everybody laughing. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> So, but let me ask you, sir. By the time, oh if God. I say we're going, listen, sir. Hey, so, I'm, I'm going to pick you up. Listen, sir. So, I'm going to pick you up. Listen, sir. Brandon. Brandon. The officer, the whole thing is for you to do yeah. the what? To so neglect the situation. Calm it down, right? No, it means you, the word you're looking for is this de-escalate. De-escalate the situation. Yeah. Are you just de-escalating, sir? I'm trying, but you're acting a fool. Sir. You're acting a whole fool. Sitting, please don't touch my children. Hey, that's the mother. Let, let them, Stop. Let them go with the mother. Stop it. Can y'all please move away? Please. I'm and just, now you scaring the kids, you f idiot. Hey, that's right. why That's why Honey Sauce would have... That's what I was telling y'all. She would have snatched them a long time ago. I'm holding my children. Don't you see your son cry? Take my children away. You mean to leave, sir? Yeah. I, I've been told you to leave. So look, if I leave, you're not going to touch me, right? Let's go. Okay. I, I left. What happened? I, I'm leaving the situation. Please don't touch me, sir. Sir. You in my way. I'm trying me. to go downstairs. Okay. You in my way. Go ahead. Go downstairs. So why are you grabbing me, sir? Come oh, on. Oh, wow. We're on live. Y'all see this, right? He's grabbing me. I hope your, your video camera's on, too. It's been grabbing on. Me. Okay. Cool. We see the actual truth. Cool. This is we got here. Walking back to me. What's your name, sir? Raya Penn. Let me get it right if so you don't want a thing. Why a pink? Can I get you? you, you it's got literally it. a giant hang tape that you can record. I understand. I understand. There's a reason you guys have never did anything wrong. Yeah, you're, you're compliant. I'm compliant as well. But I live here. My <laughs> name's on the list. So no, it's not. Leave, no, it's not. You already okay. snitched. I'm going to walk. And then we'll see what happens. Right. All right. That's the one that grabbed me and everything and told me that I need to leave my house. When I'm on the lease, did you check the lease, sir? Did you check the lease? No, I didn't check the I lease. I hope they arrested him. Nope. You didn't think about him. that, right? Nope. But you grabbed me, right, and told me to leave. You oh, yeah. removed me oh, from yeah. my house, right? Yep. Okay, so you ready for court, right? Yep. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. So, when I go back to the lease, I'm in the office. And I tell them, I've been removed from a cop. You turn around, I'm sorry. Go back upstairs. The officers observed Brandon talking on the phone and walking away from the residence. About 10 minutes after seeing Brandon return, the officers spoke with Miss Brower again. He has an alcohol issue. Okay. I had told him to leave a few days ago because he just makes stupid decisions. Okay. And I told him he had to leave. So he's been at his mom's house for the past couple of days. Okay. And I worked during the night, so I asked him, are you planning on coming back? Because I'm thinking that he had to stop drinking at that point. Okay. Um, he called me, I'd say around 9 or 10. Can I put lunch on my table? Yeah, for Okay. Um, he uh, called me a few hours ago and said that he was on his way. Um, he was at Walmart, and his mom called me and warned me, like, hey, Shauna, he's been drinking, like, I could, you know, smell alcohol on him when I... Oh, damn, even the mom on her side. ...dropped him off at Walmart, and I just wanted to give you a heads up because he claimed he was coming over here. And I was like, well, I've already told him not to come over here if he was drinking because of past stuff. Um, but he came, he had brought, like, some groceries and stuff or whatever, and he had some wine in his cart, and I told him, I said, you're not bringing that in here. You're not even supposed to be drinking, so you lucky that I'm even letting you in the house. But um, I said, you can't bring that in here. He came in with the groceries, and... He was giving my brother and sister some stuff, mm -hmm. um, but he was just acting. You know how people act when they drunk, just kind of. 
whatever. And he was being extremely loud. I told him, when I talked to him earlier, I said, hey, my mom's going to spend the night because she has to work in Alpharetta tomorrow and it's closer, you know, from her house. Um, so he was in here talking and playing with them and I asked him repeatedly, like, hey, BJ, you need to quiet down because my mom has to go to work in the morning. Um, eventually, my mom called me in the room and was like, hey, can you ask him to quiet down because it's like 2 a.m. I ain't got no sleep. Um, and while I was in there, he walked in there and... I don't remember exactly what he said, but um, he was like, I'm trying to give the kids or something some clothes, and I'm like, okay, but you're being extremely loud and she has to work. And then he was like, well, ain't nobody about to tell me to be quiet in my damn house, and this, that, and the fourth, and it just escalated from there. And then he just started having a rant, screaming to the top of his lungs, and on the phone, they said, hey, does he have a weapon? And I said, no, because I didn't know him to have a weapon. Man. In front of all and, of us. And this is why I'm on the phone with the police now and, I, and he pulled it in his waistband and he was like you can tell him I got one and I'm just sitting here like you know or whatever and he was like I ain't gonna do nothing with it though and he just sat down on this thing pretty Does much until y'all got here I don't know minutes and he just will not calm down so I tried my best not to get police involved but he's just out of control so he was he was in there the whole time with a gun and everything and he needs help He's supposed to have a 69 on him. After taking Brower's statement and confirming Brandon had left, officers departed. However, shortly after, Brower called again, reporting Brandon's return. So I'm, I'm moving my stuff. They should have known that. You know what I mean? I'm moving my stuff at the apartment. Is that a problem? Yes, that's a problem. You're supposed to go to your mom's house. Yeah, she's coming. She's getting a U-Haul. I'm removing my stuff. She's getting a U-Haul at this time? Just yes. My door open she is. came and start moving shit out the house. They open the door. I'm removing my stuff. Huh? Everything in there is mine, sir. That's no way you determine if that stuff is yours or not. Right? Um, Kashana, Kashana, everything there is mine, right? Let me call my boss. Ma'am. Huh? No, it's ours. Brandon. Just because you brought it in here doesn't mean it belongs to you. There's something Just now, <laughs> that's what you're trying to say. But it's the truth, though. When, when you when you buy for the house, nigga, the woman keeps it. Stop playing, bro. Like, and I'm not a man, but I know that. I'm not stupid. That's why I bought it. This is supposed to be for the children. All of us. However, the person that stays is going to keep the shit. Come on, bro. I, I'm sorry, I, I'm not on his side with that one. Cause why? Why would I? What? Who about to be moving furniture at two o'clock in the morning? Except a computer, I will move a computer in a minute. But that's about it. Not bought it. Me, it belongs to me. That's all why I need. Not bought. You got this. Thing. You have a receipt. Not bought it. In you have a receipt for all this stuff. Ma'am, so this is your stuff. You see that nigga ask him, do he have a receipt? Cause they on his, they on the women's side too. The women and the children keep everything, sir move along and i know i know men hate that but it's the truth it's the truth bro now all of this stuff is from, didn't I just tell you, that all you know what she can have it she can have it so Duh. why would you do this in the first place i'm trying to move my mom is coming with a u-haul i'm trying to move my stuff i'm not disturbing anybody i'm moving yes you are this, this is a big <laughs> disturbance what are you talking about see me this tomorrow that, yes to, to remove I, I don't. I don't even know why we're arguing. You're a grown man. Hard to move my stuff, sir. Yes. It's three o'clock in the morning. Come like, on, come man. Come on. What are we? What? It is three o'clock in the morning. I'm sorry. I'm thinking. This You're not. You're not thinking. Wrong. I'm not. But this is my apartment. This is my stuff. Everything in there is mine. Let so. me ask you something. Do I have to stay here until your ride gets here to babysit you? Yeah. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. You know what? Don't you? Yeah, I can move it back in there. I come Damn back to my stuff. Um, I it back. You just threw all of my stuff. Um, can I ask you one question, sir? Before y'all leave, can y'all charge my phone for me? Please, please. Uh, I'll charge your phone. Thank you, sir. I believe my phone Apparently, is Apparently, I, I got to stay here with you. Yes, her mom, bro. Her, mo her mother. She's not supposed to be here. I just left for the last four days. Came back. Her mom got a problem. You know what I'm saying? In my home. The cop did not feel like doing that paperwork. I would have had to do it and take his ass to jail. Get him. You ain't about to get on my nerves all night. Well, Why'd you leave for four days? Sit, sitting in. Why'd you leave for four days? Because we have problems going on. Yeah, and she said it sounds like it's about alcohol. 
Alcohol? Yeah, it says you keep drinking. We both drink alcohol. Okay. No, you can't handle it, though. You can't handle it. Yes, sir. But sounds like you, from what everybody's saying, you have the problem with alcohol. Possibly. Possibly not. What stuff are you trying to take right Mr. now? Mr. Mouse, can you listen to me? Everything in there is mine. And you're not gonna do you're not gonna be moving it out at three o'clock in the morning. I understand. I won't. I but if, if she contests it and says, Hey, this stuff is ours, it's not just his, then that's she, something she, you have to go to court I for. She wanna play that game? That's cool. I'm hell about to go to court for all of that. Why? No. But you would have had to really do some grimy, dirty shit to me. You and the kids, though. Like, because I'm not about to go to court about no TVs and no couch. No! <laughs> I'll leave. No, and no, tomorrow, no. I'm taking my stuff. I will call my own police officers. It's not a problem. And I'm having huh? my own lawsuit. This is, this is going to be a lawsuit. Because uh. she's not already attacked my stuff. She's going to attack me. I didn't call the police officers. I didn't call y'all because she attacked me. Her. Yes, she did. You attacked my... Miss, miss, don't, don't, just stay inside. I, hey, I don't know how to She you. attacked me. She attacked the 70 inch. I called the police first. That nigga says she attacked me. She attacked the 70 inch. I'm holding my children and I'm not being contempt. I'm not being able to grab my stuff because she's trying to say she did what with it? She did what to my stuff? She bought it? Aiden, come on. Here, grab Are y'all leaving? I don't know. Downstairs. You don't know? Nope. Okay. But what was I trying to do, Chrishell? I was trying to give y'all what? Shoes and clothes, right? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Okay. I'm trying to make sure y'all straight for shoot for um school and stuff. Damn, that's a sister too. That mama got a lot of kids. That's all I was trying to do. Like she put it, you right. put it there. That, yeah. You know, something else we do in Atlanta. Well, I don't clearly, but some people do in Atlanta. They will live in Alpharetta and get a job all the way in in Jonesboro. Why? It's too far. It's too far. It's just, it don't make sense, y'all. Yeah, it is your fault. You want stuff back inside? <laughs> it's not your It's just, it's too it's much. Stuff. And we can decide how it's going to be distributed. But you're not going to come over here and talk to y'all. You're right. Hey, where are you going? Hey. Come back upstairs, stop. Uh, hey, no, stop. I'm just going to take it. Why, where's he going? Oh, my uh, God. Enough with the yelling. I'm sorry that y'all have to Come here, Aiden. Aiden, Aiden, come here now. I keep under there. Wrap it up. Uh, come on. What are you doing? Yeah, you're going to have to go to jail, Put my boy. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. I'm not going to tell you again. Are you, are my head all behind my back. I'm trying to get my child, bro. Where's my son? He just ran downstairs. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, you just took his TV away from him. He don't like you. He liked the TV. Hell wrong with you. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I'm trying to get my child. I should have just left on. Okay. Her. Come on. Watch your steps. Bro, my grandma's coming to pick me up. Where's my son? Can you find... Trying to find my son, bro. Like, what the f***, bro? This too much, bro. This too much, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. Are you serious? Are you serious, bro? Bro, I didn't do anything, bro. I'm looking for my son. Where's my son? Sir, can you follow my son? Brandon Howard's disruptive behavior resulted in his arrest for disorderly conduct. Disorderly conduct. Oh, that's it. Cha. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. That was just long-winded for nothing. <laughs> Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, y'all.